welcome back to Iron Bread. Yes, the game that makes me actually wish to play other rage games because this thing is like a hemorrhoid. It's painful, it's always there, and it makes you cry. And if you don't know what one of those are, don't Google it, you'll have a bad time. Anyway, we are back with this infernal thing. I'm so glad I'm getting through this now. We Last episode we were in the garage and well I struggled mainly to get out the fucking bin. But now we are outside. We are wild toast. We are savage. Whoa, not toast. We want to become savage toast. At the moment we are wild bread. We are primordial bread. So let's go in the garden. Hopefully there's a gnome because well gnomes are just funny when they break. And you know, gnomes are just funny. Like when you pick them up and you throw them up and you hear the creak and you hear the crash of the pottery, it's just funny. It's like, oh no, my nose. And if you're wondering, yes, I have lost my mind. Treatment notes. I visited Mr. Burton today. Oh, blur, I can't fucking speak. Despite his drowsiness from the medication we administered, that means you knocked his ass out. Yesterday, we went ahead with a session. He was very adamant that I detail exactly what I saw when I dropped off his car. And if I had seen any signs of toast in the garage, I didn't recall seeing any toast. Though once I mentioned that some sort of his appliances were turned on, he became very alarmed. I tried to calm him down by mentioning that I did place his bins outside. While I did look at the loaf, it seemed like just an ordinary loaf of bread. He relaxed for a few seconds until I specified that I had left the loaf on top of the bins. I sent Mr. Merton into a panic and he lashed out and attempted to escape the room. Da -da -da. Unfortunately, I had to end the session by early by calling in security to restrain him. That means to get the straight jacket so that he can mumble kumbaya to himself like I'm happy. <laughs> anyway, I thought that said LSD in the top then. Clearly the medication isn't working. Mr. Merton still truly believes this bread is somehow taking on a life of its own to become toast. When you say it out loud, it becomes clear how far his mental state has fallen. It never climbed. I think it is best I hold off this session tomorrow while I investigate some alternative treatments as the current methods are evidently not working. Well, no shit, a tranquilizer dart and a restraint jacket don't do shit. Become toast! Uh, who the fuck is texting me? Fuck off! Oh no, not another bin! Oh, oh, it's so quiet. Oh, it's so quiet and lovely. Where the hell do I go? Oh no. This looks... Ooh! Um... Can I? Eh. <gasps> nope. We can stay there, okay? <laughs> Fucking grab something! <laughs> I'm taking my time. I'm going to remain calm. I'm going to remain cool. I'm getting a bit high. <sighs> oh no, 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 no. <laughs> I didn't panic. Shut up. I, I didn't panic. I didn't panic. Yes, you. I'm talking to you. The doubter. You. Yeah, I see you watching. I see you doubting me. What the fuck am I doing? Oh. 
Oh, 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 give me the money. Get! Ha! Ha! It is a small victory, but I'll fucking take it. Oh, oh, it's so long. It's so far to go. Uh, it sounds like a pleasure session whenever I smack it. Uh. Right, I can rest there. So. Away we go. Fail back to the How the fuck am I going to get out that? I'm just going to scooch along here. Eh, 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 eh. Ah, no! No, 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 no. If I could not fuck it up this time, that would be great. Hibuski! Ah! A grip come back. Um, um,
Oh! Oh, I need to go and change my pants after that manoeuvre! Still don't know where the fuck I need to go! See, that I can navigate, but I can't get out of a bin. Yes, I have graduated from gradual noises to gibberish. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, that's so far. Wait a minute, can I just go in the car? I'm gonna see if I can just spider man my way across this. to say I planned that, but I would be a bigger liar than O.J. Simpson, who of course was completely uh, innocent, but that's another topic because I know someone's going to be like, the glove didn't fit, I don't give a fuck, he did it, Woo! nailed it. Good bread. Good bread. <sighs> Don't tell me I have to grab a match. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, I'm sort of toast. Can I... Can I just toast myself on this match? <laughs> K 
come on! Well, I'm severely fucking burnt, but I don't care. That is not what I wanted to do. I'm toasting myself on this map. <gasps> yes! Oh! Oh! That was the easiest one we've ever done! Oh, thank God we did not have to actually pick up the match! Oh my God! Hey, I got the achievement! to test myself hey that only took half an hour you know on editing this episode will obviously be shorter but I'm happy with that I'm very happy um fuck okay but anyway though I have been your host Mr Gage if you see that like button and you liked hearing me losing my mind Go ahead and give it a little tickle. If that subscribe button is angry at you and it's all red saying, why are you not subscribed to this awesome person? Smack it in the face so that it goes pale with fright and get yourself subscribed. Because more stuff like this is coming on the way because, well, I'm sticking to it so it's new. Hey, hey. But anyway, I've been your host, Mr. Gage. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you all so very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.